Hi everybody, I am Steve and I'm a musician and today I'm going to give you the most basic day one lesson on playing the trombone. This is my trombone, half of my trombone. I like this instrument. It comes in two pieces and you need to put those two pieces together. So, I'll show you how you put it together. On this particular instrument, you simply slide them together and give it a little bit of a twist until you have it in place. For most of you, however, there is going to be a little nut here that you're going to need to screw down. This trombone does not have that, but yours likely will. Actually, I prefer it that way, but I do love this particular trombone, so I'm going to keep it the way it is. The next thing you need to do is take your mouthpiece, put the mouthpiece in, with a little bit of a twist and it's together now there's something you should know there's this little thing here a keeper and if this keeper is open your slide will fall not good so we keep that keeper there as much as you need it to keep the slide from falling you'll notice i have this habit of putting my pinky here and that helps keep my slide from crashing on the ground all right before you play you need to lubricate the slide. That means put something to make the slide slippery. Now, for more advanced players, why are you watching the video if you're, well, maybe you want it to help your students. Okay. But for more advanced players, you're going to use some sort of a trombone slide cream. Cold cream works great, and a spray bottle. However, since this video is for the absolute beginners, I'm going to show you what you do with oil. Now, I use cream on this trombone, so I don't want to mix the oil with that cream, so I'm just going to pretend to put the oil on. What you do is this. You move the keeper, open the slide, and you would just dribble a little oil right on that slide. And you'd work it back and forth. Put the keeper back. Make sure you do that. All right, now how to hold the trombone. I'm gonna take your hand like this, right? And there's this little cross piece. I'm gonna take my hand and I'm going like this. Zonk, see that? I then take my, these fingers, everything but my pointer, and I wrap it around. See that again? Poof. And I wrap it around and my pointer finger goes here up by my mouthpiece. Okay, then I take let me use my other hand. I take these little grooves here. Those little grooves are what are going to go right around here. See that? And my thumb is in the back of it. So that way I can move the slide out and in. Now, to make a sound, I do what I would do with any other brass instrument. I'm going to buzz my lips. Now, if you have trouble doing that, some people do, just pretend you're spitting a bug out of your mouth. <coughs> It'll work. And we get, it's good to wet your lips too. Mmm, yeah. And we have a sound. Now we can change the pitch of our trombone, change the notes in two ways. One is by going, changing how we're buzzing. Ooh, that was gross. That was kind of ugly. Okay, and the second is by using the slide. And let's face it, when you thought about playing trombone, the slide is what was cool, and it is cool. So, since I have given you the very basics, I am not going to end this video until I do a nice slide glissando for you. Please, pick up a trombone. It's great. Learn it. Get yourself a teacher at your local music store or somebody who lives near you who can help you learn to play. Here we go.